I'm recording this the day after the attack on the Capitol. I'm shaken, as I'm sure all of you are. And I'm having a lot of trouble processing it, which has made it even more difficult to explain it to our kids while assuring them that they're safe. I have a session with my therapist this afternoon, and the timing could not be more crucial. But it got me thinking, how are therapists taking care of their mental health? Consider their double burden. They're experiencing unprecedented events like the pandemic and watching domestic terrorism and sedition unfold, and they have to counsel and comfort their clients who are impacted by it. That's a tall order. Today I want to discuss what are, in my opinion, and based on my experience, the two essential components to successfully manage your mental health. A solid support system and a treatment plan. My 20s were a disaster and the darkest period of my life because I wasn't receiving the proper support and treatment for my depression and anxiety. A big part of that is I didn't know what I didn't know. I didn't know that depression and anxiety were illnesses and not merely states of mind. I didn't know how to go all in when it came to help. I submitted to the stigma. But eventually I got my shit together and seized the support of my family and developed a treatment plan with the resources that were available to me. Looking back and looking at some people I know who are struggling now, I've determined that if you don't have a support system, and a treatment plan, you have no chance. It's like taking a sturgeon out of Lake Michigan, dropping it on Michigan Avenue, and expecting it to somehow get back to water. By the way, it's not easy. It took me 10 years and a lot of trial and error. But if I knew then what I know now, I would have gotten there a lot sooner. Build a support system and audition therapists until you find the right fit. Do me a solid and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time.